I just want to see more from Will Lewis, I guess. Um, but I think it's going to be like, you know, one team's going to win seven, one team's going to win eight. Like, it's going to be really close for a um, – but, yeah. Uh, so it should be a really competitive division. So um, we need your official uh, rankings, Casey. You know, I, I'll get mine for – I'll give you a second to think. I got the Texans at one, TJ Stroud. Expect them to kind of capitalize on what they did last year, added talent on both sides of the ball. A lot of confidence on that team going with Texas at one. Colt at two. I think a healthy Anthony Richardson with Shane Steichen is a recipe for success. Um, I think this is a well-rounded team who, if Shane is able to unlock Anthony Richardson, this could be a potential top five quarterback. I'm not saying this year, but in the future, most definitely. Um, I got the Titans at three. Love the additions that they've made in their coaching position. Obviously, Brian Callahan has history of coaching very great quarterbacks and Peyton Manning, Matthew Stafford, Joe Burrow, Derek Carr in his MVP year. I like the additions they made. Get LeJerry Sneed, best man-to-man quarter in football last year. The Chiefs don't win the bowl without him, without a doubt. So I got the Titans at three, Jaguars at four. Trevor Lawrence is a great player. I think he's going to have a better year than he did last year. This offense, the passing, you know, um, the the pass block, the O-line is not great. The running game is not explosive. It's non-existent. Um, the defense isn't great all around. I just don't think they're a good enough team. That's my, that's my rank. Now you give yours, sir. I got the Texans at one. Um, love the additions. CJ going to year two. It's going to be a great season for them. Um, going to be very explosive in the passing game. Um, so, yeah, I got the Texans at one. Sneaky good under um, under the radar additions on defense as well. So, Texans at one. Colts at two. Richardson. Just got to stay healthy. You know, I want to see him healthy all year just to see what he can do, you know, in Shane Sagan's offense. Um and yeah, I think Jonathan Taylor's gonna bounce back, have a really high level season to, you know, put less pressure on Richardson um in that passing game. But, you know, I think defensively they're also really solid. So I really like the Colts. Um I'm going Jags at three. Just show love to Trevor. Um you know, I I I I'm not high on them to be a playoff team, but I still think they're just a good enough team to you know, win eight games, nine games potentially, maybe even ten if they have a really good year. But yeah, just the overall the roster has too many questions, and um, so I got them at three, and then four. I can definitely see the Titans being you know third potentially, but it's just Will Levis um, question marks. But you know, Callahan's gonna be huge for his development, and you know I liked some of the pieces they added for sure. So one of the better fourth place teams, regardless. Um, you know, it's a really good division, top to bottom. No, no real, you know, bad team. So, but yeah, I got, I got those four. I feel you stood on business. You know, what I'm saying You're faithful to your guy. I respect that. You know, we're gonna see, man. You actually get to see game one. The Chicago Bears, your team, yep. <laughs> plays the Tennessee Titans. Are you at home? You're at home, right? Yeah, it's in it's in Chicago. You might have to catch that game, dude, if you can. Caleb, Caleb's first game. That'd be fire. Yeah. Be See, season sure. opener. So, yeah. man, I think if Will Levis is able to go in there, you know, in the Chicago building, who is getting the number one draft pick, obviously, in Caleb Williams, who has made some very great moves, you know, this offseason um, and is looking to have a much better year. Um, if he's able to go in there and beat them, whew, that'd, that's be, a that'd sneaky, be a statement. That's a sneaky big first week for both sides, for real, because, yeah. no. A lot of momentum can be gained from that win. Um, so, um, I also think the Cubs play the Yankees that weekend. So I, would, I might, I might catch that game too.